everybody, welcome back to Jared Takes the L, and welcome to Dave the Diver. Now this is a a game that I've heard a lot about, actually. I've heard it's really, really good. Uh, when I went to look the game up, I saw the reviews it had, and it had like 9 out of 10, 10 out of 10. I, I, I couldn't believe it, and I don't even really know what this game is about, other than it's about a guy named Dave, and I guess he's a diver. That's all I really know. I don't know much else about it other than the very, very brief things that I've seen. I thought I saw something about you also run a sushi restaurant. I don't know if that's actually true. That may have just been something I saw in a dream, I don't know. But I'm pretty sure that's something I saw. Um, but that's what I do with a lot of games. I tend to just not look things up. I also don't do the tutorials for some reason, as many of you know, and that never goes well. So let's just hop into this game. Oh, we got a cute little cutscene too. Very relaxing little... Oh! Okay. Okay, well, I have no idea what is being said here, but... It seems something about... I was calling maybe about the sushi. There we go, that's that's our introduction. That's all we really get about this game. Of course, root beer, good choice, good choice. Man, I love this little introduction. This is so neat. This is such a it's just such a nice, relaxing little game. It's actually quite, quite loud in my ears. There we go. I, I, don't, I don't even want to skip this. This is just a really relaxing introductory cutscene. <laughs> it's just, it's just him flying, and he just takes a sip of root beer. That, that's the life right there. That's the life for me. <laughs> I love, I love music right here. Oh, that's the plane. I was like, I was hearing some noises in the back. I thought, I thought maybe someone was trying to talk to me, like in real life here. But that was the, <laughs> was the sounds of the plane, like over the the loudspeaker. All right, what do we got? What what is this game gonna be about? Other than Dave and and diving. Oh. oh. This is uh, this is Cobra. Oh, Dave, you got here quickly. Well, I was told to hurry here. I was on vacation, you know. So where's the sushi at? Haha! <laughs> don't rush yourself. Have a look around. Look at this giant blue hole. I've never seen anything like this. It's not just the size. Every time you enter the giant blue hole, the terrain and ecology changes. Which means... This could be an incredible business opportunity. Yeah. What kind of business? Well, we can discuss that later. I heard you took a break from diving. How about warming up? I'll guide you from here. Go ahead and jump on in. Hmm, I don't have a good feeling about this. Son of a gun, it actually is a sushi restaurant. Okay, so I did not... I wasn't wrong. Okay, try moving the arrow with L. Okay. And then hit X to dive. Let's go for it. Oh, we don't actually get to see any animation for, for diving in? Okay, well, that's okay. I guess, is this going to just be like a non-horror version of Subnautica? <laughs> nice form, haha. <laughs> Alright, how about try stretching out a bit? Try moving to the marked area. With ZL, you can move quickly. Remember that this, speed up, this speeds up oxygen consumption. This looks actually really nice. Good, looks like your skills are intact. Your moves are as nimble as a freshwater snail. Let's now practice using the weapon you'll need in contingencies, the dive knife. 
Try using the survival knife on small fish. You can use the B button. Come here. Yeah. <laughs> okay, well, I didn't hit anything. Well done, smooth and quick. And finally, you haven't forgotten how to use the harpoon, have you? The harpoon? Well, I haven't used one in a long time. Do you aim first and then... Looks like you'll need some practice. Let's try using the harpoon to catch, let's say, three fish. Aim with A and fire with ZR. Okay. Hi. I messed up. Uh... Gosh dang it. Come here. <laughs> no. You. Got it. That was kind of brutal, but okay. Got him. What? I completely missed. Gosh dang it. Alright. Which one of you wants to be the lucky one? Oh, gosh dang it. They're all swimming away from me. I mean, that makes sense, don't get me wrong, but... There we go! Oh, that was only two fish, but that's alright. Okay, so I, I see, so we literally just have to go down here and catch fish. I mean, that's... would make sense, you know? It's almost like, it almost feels like a tycoon kind of game. I was just talking about this when I did one of my Roblox videos. Okay, now that you got the hang of it, let's get down to business. Dave, you love sushi, right? For sure, that soft fish meat with oily rice. Oh man, that's just the best. Aha, well listen up. I have a friend who is a sushi chef who left the business for a while. He has a bit of a sharp tongue and a slight temper, but he has one skill that I can guarantee is unmatched in the world. It is right here that I started a restaurant with my friend that sells one-of-a-kind sushi. The sushi sold here is made from fresh fish caught from the blue hole where fish from all over the world can be found. Don't you think people will just go nuts for it? Yum, I'm already craving it. Haha, I bet so. Why don't you join in on this awesome venture as well? What do you say? I mean, I love eating, but I don't know a thing about cooking. Nothing to worry about, the restaurant is all ready. All you need to do is dive to get the ingredients. Doesn't sound too bad, right? What if I decline? Does the game just end? I guess I won't do that. So I can eat as much sushi as I want? Yeah, sure. You have to pay, though. What? Can't wait to check it out. The sushi restaurant next to the Blue Hole. It was supposed to open tonight, but I'm not sure if it's ready. Let's go have a chat at the restaurant. Press X at the arrow. Oh, there we go. Yes. Man, I don't even get free sushi? That's ridiculous. I'm the one going down and getting all the ingredients. Hey, Bancho, are we all ready to open? As you can see, it's ready just in time. Oh, it's already finished? You? Ah, you were the fisherman Cobra was talking about. Well, I'm more of a diver than a fisherman. Alright, anyway, it's nice to meet you. I'm Bancho. So, you like sushi? I sure do. Tuna belly, eel, sea urchin. Oh boy, just thinking about it makes my mouth water. Hmm, just as mediocre as expected. Sushi is a food that combines the soul of sea and land. It symbolizes Mother Nature herself. Most people, however, have only tasted more accessible fish just like you. How empty a life is one that ends... Well, let me try that again. How empty a life is one that ends without ever tasting the beauty Mother Nature can offer. My calling is to bring the taste of Mother Nature to everyone. Nope. What the heck's happening? Holy crap! An, an earthquake? Hmm, the interior is really quite a mess. Yeah, looks like we'll have to delay the opening today. You know what? I spent all my money getting this restaurant ready. I'll have to recover the repair cost through doing business. In this state? Uh, in the end, the importance of a restaurant is the taste. First, we need ingredients. Did you bring anything? Well, I have something I just caught. Only three fish? This won't be nearly enough to serve the guests. Please go and catch seven more fish first. Oh, and the restaurant is going to be open only in the evening. Won't that decrease sales? You think we should invite customers without adequate preparation just to make a little more money? 
It is a chef's duty to prepare the best possible food with meticulous precision, just as a warrior sharpens his sword on a whetstone. Good lord. <laughs> you will need to get me the best quality ingredients during the day. Okay. Alright, so we have to go catch seven more fish. Will do. Alright, I like this. This is fun. I like the uh, I like the idea behind this. I wonder what caused that earthquake, though. I wonder if we if we ever find out. It could have. I mean, it could have. I guess just been a really poorly timed earthquake. But <laughs> it seems Bancho is really passionate about his work. He may not talk about personal stuff, but this guy could talk about sushi all night. I haven't seen Bancho so enthusiastic since the incident. It's nice to see him like this. So great. The incident. Oops. Maybe I shouldn't have brought it up. Well, anyway, we need more ingredients, so go catch seven fish first. Oh, that's interesting. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and dive in. All right, so we need seven fish. Once we get that, we can go back. And then I guess... I guess what... What do, what do I end up doing in the sushi restaurant? Probably like... Probably like a waiter or something. Because, like, like he said, he's not a cook or anything, so I don't know what else he'd really be able to do. Right, here we go. Ah, oh, I missed. Gosh dang it. Oh, there we go. Got one. Alright, yellow tag. There we go. Butterfly fish? Gotcha. Another pyramid butterfly fish. Damn. Okay. I'm just gonna keep catching the same same kinds of fish, I guess. The underwater part is really well done, honestly. Like, it looks really good. So, kudos to, uh, the developers for this, because it looks, it looks outstanding. Alright, I need, I still need two more. There we go. Another one of these things, and then... Uh, who wants to be last? Oh, yeah, those are fish. They're so tiny. Got them anyways, alright, cool. Alright, we got them. Yeah, return the boat. We got what we needed. We got seven fish. We can go make some sushi. I actually am personally not a huge fan of sushi. Uh, I have I have had it. I'm not a big fan of it. Oh, it's nighttime. Wow. Well, all right, looks like you caught quite a few. At this rate, we'll make boatloads of money in no time. Oh, so this guy's just Mr. Krabs. My, my, would you look at the time? We'll have to hurry up and get things ready. Why don't you head to the sushi bar? All right, we'll do. Uh, okay. Bring up your day and get things ready. By the way, you'll only be able to dive once in the morning and once in the afternoon. Get the ingredients ready before the dinner hours start. All right, hopefully this goes well. <laughs> You can't cook any more dishes once the wasabi runs out. Keep an eye on how much is left and refill it before it runs out. Incho, how are the preparations coming along? I think we're mostly set. That's good. Here's to a great evening. Where do you think you're going? Didn't you hear from Cobra? You're to help me run the sushi bar from today onwards. What? I, I don't understand. Cobra told me that there would be somebody to help with the ingredients and serving. He said all I needed to do is cook. And who else is there for that but you? Wait, I've never worked at a restaurant before. The guests will be here soon. I'll give you a quick primer, so pay attention. What? <laughs> Open the ingredients below. Here you can check your fish, crops, sauces, and all the other materials you have. For now, that's all you need to know. Come back later for more information. Alright, now I'll show you how to register actual items to the menu. New recipes need to be added to the menu before they can be sold to customers. Here's the sushi recipe for the fish you required earlier, so try registering that to the menu. Uh, this one? 
Uh, sure. Alright, that probably wasn't that hard. Setting ingredients to auto-supply will make things a bit more convenient. Let me repeat, only food on the menu can be sold. If you run out of ingredients, you'll have to replace items. Okay. You can also enhance the flavor of the dishes, so try it out when you have enough ingredients. Now use the ingredients you caught to fill out the menu as much as you can. Okay. Get this one. This one. And this one. Okay. That uh, looks good. How long are you going to stand there talking? Give me a cup of, of green tea to quench my thirst. Hmm, have you perhaps poured green tea before? No, only soft drinks, I think. Tsk, I'll tell you how. Go over to Cobra. Pour the right amount. Okay. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Perfect. Look at that, I'm, I'm awesome at this. I, I did play the Cooking Mama games, you know, when I was a kid, so that, that clearly is helping me here. Customers who drink green tea of a good or higher grade will pay more. Okay. As expected, Bancho's green tea is quite something. That tea really got my appetite going. Is there something to eat, perhaps? Demanding as always. Why don't you try serving him some food while you're at it? Okay, he's cooking right now. Yes. Come over to where I am and take this food. I grabbed it. Oh, there we go. You can dash while serving food. You see all to move quickly, but I have to watch, watch my stamina. Hello? You sent the package last week, you say? What in the world? Let me check on that. What? Cobra didn't even eat. He's always distracted like that. The food can't be reused, so we'll have to throw it out. It seems like such a waste to throw it away. Bencho Sushi never reuses food. We do not put food made for guests on the table twice. Well, alright. That's a shame. Everything looks about ready. Hmm, haven't cooked for customers in a while. Kinda nervous. Don't forget to press Y after filling the menu for business to begin. Oh boy, here we go. Alright, everything should be good, right? So we can open? Let's do this thing. I like this. This is fun. Oh, look at that. Oh, oh, wow. We already got customers. Uh, what do I have to do? Green tea? You got it. Perfect. Alright, there's that. There's that. Alright, we got food. We got food. Who ordered it? Right here. Enjoy. Alright, food. Oh, right here. Perfect. We got, uh, you guys both ordered it. I guess, I think you did it first, right? Okay. Creep, I got two green teas? Alright, I'm coming, I'm coming. I gotta, I gotta run. Here. Okay, I'm right here, I'm right here, I'm right here. No, I did the wrong one, I did the wrong one. Shoot. Oh, I did too much. Oh, that no, was perfect. I'm sorry, I messed up. Okay. Alright, uh, here. Okay. I mean, surprisingly, it seems fairly busy, you know? We're getting quite a, quite a few people in here. There we go. I think we're just waiting on the last guy's order here. There we go. All done? Alright, thanks for coming. It. Closed for the day. Nice. All right, we, we didn't do too bad. Four point six stars. That's not bad. Definitely, we'll take that. Phew. Work's finally done for the day. My back and legs hurt. You were a bit clumsy, but not bad for a first day. Try a little harder next time. I suppose coming from you, that's a compliment. A man should not feel gratification from simple compliments. <laughs> yeah, yeah, all right. In any case, a toast to the opening of Bancho Sushi. No idea where Cobra ended up going.
No. What the heck is this? How'd you not see that? <laughs> it was right there. You could easily see that. Oh! What? Is that the Kraken? <laughs> that is not what I was expecting to see. Okay. I was not expecting to see the Kraken. Oh, look at that. It's a rainy day. Uh, that was... Hmm, are you the man who's been diving around <laughs> here? Yeah, I think so. I was expecting a more professional looking guy. I can hear you, you know. In any case, can you do something for me? Shouldn't you tell me who you are first? I'm Ellie. I study biology at the local graduate school. I've come out to investigate after reports of anomalies in the area. Satisfied? Okay, so what do you want? I'd like to study the ecology of this blue hole. Get me some uh, agar and red starfish first. I don't think it's a good idea to ask for just one of each, so get me two of each. Your tone makes me want to refuse. Hmm, I've got a reward, but if you don't want it, that's fine by me. A uh, reward? Well, I wasn't refusing. I'm just saying you could ask more nicely. In any case, please hurry. Don't dally. Alright, so I have... I have a smart... Okay, apparently my smartphone. How do I do my... Oh, I have... How do I do that? Oh, that's really cool, actually. You can do all this different stuff on here. There's a mail. Do you want to be rich? Yeah, I don't think that's legitimate. <laughs> that's actually really neat. There's a weather app? Album? Calculator? That's actually really cool. You can call? You, you guys should call people? What is it? Do you want to learn to cook, perhaps? No, I just came to see if you needed any particular ingredients. A master chef can cook with any ingredients. I'll show you the best food possible, regardless of what you bring me. Just bring me lots of it. Huh. That's funny. Alright. There's even mini games too. Alright. Well, you know, I think we're going to go ahead and end the episode here, guys. But this has been Dave the Diver. I'm actually a huge fan of this game. It looks like there's going to be some uh, interesting story going on here, too. Especially with the introduction of the Kraken, which I never would have guessed. Um, I also did remember, I just remembered when the Kraken showed up, they actually released a DLC for this game for Godzilla as well, so if you guys do want to see that, um, I'll definitely play that on the channel as well, but that's going to do it for today, guys. If you enjoyed, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know if you want to see more Dave the Diver, because I definitely would love to play more of this game. Um, but that's going to do it for today, guys. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everybody. <laughs>